Through the Looking Glass and What Alice Found There by Lewis Carroll Child of the pure, unclouded brow and dreaming eyes of wonder, though time be fleet and I and thou are half a life asunder, thy loving smile will surely hail the love gift of a fairy tale. I have not seen thy sunny face, nor heard thy silver laughter. No thought of me shall find a place in thy young life's hereafter. Enough that now thou wilt not fail to listen to my fairy tale. A tale begun in other days, when summer suns were glowing, a simple chime that served to time the rhythm of our rowing whose echoes live in memory yet, though envious years would say forget. Come, hearken then, ere voice of dread, with bitter tidings laden, shall summon to unwelcome bed a melancholy maiden. We are but older children, dear, who fret to find our bedtime near. Without the frost, the blinding snow, the storm wind's moody madness, Within the firelight's ruddy glow and childhood's nest of gladness. The magic words shall hold thee fast, thou shalt not heed the raving blast. And though the shadow of a sigh may tremble through the story, for happy summer days gone by and vanished summer glory, it shall not touch with breath of bale the pleasance of our fairy tale. Preface As the chess problem, given on a previous page, has puzzled some of my readers, it may be well to explain that it is correctly worked out, so far as the moves are concerned. The alternation of red and white is perhaps not so strictly observed as it might be, and the castling of the three queens is merely a way of saying that they entered the palace. But the check of the white king at move six, the capture of the red knight at move seven, and the final checkmate of the red king will be found, by anyone who will take the trouble to set the pieces and play the moves as directed, to be strictly in accordance with the laws of the game. The new words in the poem Jabberwocky, see page 19, have given rise to some differences of opinion as to their pronunciation, so it may be well to give instructions on that point also. Pronounce slithy as if it were the two words sly and the. Make the G hard in gyre and gimbal and pronounce wrath to rhyme with bath, or wrath to rhyme with bath. Christmas, 1896.